Firstly, let's download and install Alama. Use the link in the description and click on download for Windows Preview. Once downloaded, run the setup file. Click on Install to install Alama. Next, let's download the Phi 3 model using Alama. Open Alama.com and click on Models. Scroll down and click on Phi 3. If you don't see it at first, you can search for it as well. Here, copy the command to download Phi 3. Next, open the command prompt or any terminal app of your choice from the start menu. Here, paste the copied command. Hit enter and wait for Phi 3 to download on your machine. Once you see the send a message message, you're ready to start chatting with the model locally. Use the link in the description and click on LM Studio for Windows to download it. Once downloaded, run the installer and let the LM Studio install. Next is to download Phi 3 GUF file. You won't be able to search for and download Phi 3 from within LM Studio itself. You'll need to get the Phi 3 GUF file separately. Use the link given in the description and click on Files. Here, you'll find two versions of the Phi 3 model. Select one. For our purposes, we're selecting the smaller version. Click on Download.
Next, we're going to load the downloaded Phi 3 model. Open LM Studio and click on my models on the left. Take note of the local models folder. This is where we need to move the downloaded Phi 3 GUF file. Click on Show in File Explorer to open the directory. Here, create a new folder titled Microsoft. Within the Microsoft folder, create another folder titled Phi 3. Paste the downloaded Phi 3 GUF file within the Phi 3 folder. Once you've moved the Phi 3 GUF file, it will appear in the LM Studio. You may need to restart LM Studio for it to recognize Phi 3 in its directory. <laughs> to load the Phi 3 model, click on the AI chat option on the left. Click on Select a model to load. Select the Phi 3 model and wait for it to load. Once done, you can start chatting with Phi 3. However, we recommend offloading the model to the GPU so your CPU doesn't come under undue pressure. To do so, under System Prompt on the right, click on Advanced Configuration then Hardware Settings.